par ce temps exceptionnel, exceptionnel, à Kiestel, il y a microclimat. There is a ma In Kiestel, we have a use with sun. Welcome, welcome in France. Welcome in the Hauts de France, as the mayor said yesterday. Uh, welcome in the Kiestel, this uh, small village, which is, uh, and we all think it is, uh, a kind of the center of the world. <laughs> and in a way, maybe it was not true yesterday, it's true today. Merci. On est maintenant à Kiestel, le centre du monde, grâce à tous les étrangers qui sont venus se joindre à Cyrus et à Cecilia. Uh, first, uh, I have also to thank uh, the Order of Malta, who is there for your security. You have also all the scouts that came and helped the parking and help uh, babysitting and uh, make a lot of work with the, the flowers. Then thank you for the scouts of Air Solalis and Saint Omer. And I will stop there the thanks because there's too many people to thank anyway. <laughs> Now I will uh, introduce a new family. Uh, and Brad uh, <laughs> Gentry <laughs> obviously and um, they will start and I'll answer and Eugenie which is very French as a name obviously but not totally because it's coming from Denmark in Central oh. Merci. Bonsoir. Brad et moi sommes très heureux d'être ici avec vous, notre famille et nos amis. Nous voudrions d'abord remercier Sarah et Edouard d'avoir créé cette soirée remarquable, mais encore plus que pour leur générosité d'esprit et leur conviction fondamentale de l'essence de la famille. Good evening, Brad and I are so very happy to be here with you, our family and friends, and would like to thank Sarah and Edward for creating this remarkable evening, but even more for their generosity of spirit and their fundamental belief in the essence of family. Nous souhaitons également remercier les grands-parents, May Elian de Lancazon, Sally et Frank Pedraza, qui sont ici ce soir, et ceux qui ne sont pas plus parmi nous, le général de Dantezon, Mary Jane et Stokes Gentry, ainsi que Patricia et Jacob Isbranson. Et merci à vous tous, réunis ici ce soir, de vous être joints à nous pour cette joyeuse fête. We wish also to thank the grandparents, May Elian de Dantezon, Sally and Frank Pedraza, who are with us tonight, and those who are no longer with us, the General de Lancazon, Mary Jane and Stokes Gentry, and Patricia and Jacob Isfranson. And we thank you all assembled here tonight for joining us in this happy celebration. La famille Lancazon nous a fait sentir nous que nous faisions vraiment partie de la famille. C'est tellement vrai qu'une fois j'ai dit à Cecilia, ta famille. Elle, a, elle, a, elle répondit rapidement, tu veux dire notre famille? <rire> Et ainsi, il est agréable, agréable d'en profiter de ces nombreuses connexions à travers et entre les familles, qui se soient dans la nature sauvage des Adirondacks d'Ithaca, ici à la Fay, ou même de Brooklyn Heights. They have made us feel so much a part of their family, so much so that when once I said to Cecilia, your family, she quickly replied, you mean our family? 
And so it is lovely to enjoy the multiple connections across and between the families, whether in the wilds of the Adirondacks, Ithaca, here at La Prairie, or indeed Brooklyn Heights at Club Geralaman. <laughs> Cecilia a jeté un sort à Cyrus. Il est vraiment un... Et oui, nous aussi. Un peu de temps à des moments importants de notre vie, elle a été présente non seulement pour Cyrus, mais chacun de nous, Paige, Brad et moi. Avec un mot gentil, des conseils avisés et surtout avec une étincelle dans ses yeux et sentir dans son sourire qui éclaire une pièce. Elle est vraiment magique. Cecilia has cast a spell on Cyrus. He is smitten, and so we are too. In a short time, at important moments in our lives, she has been there not only for Cyrus, but for each of us, Paige, Brad, and me. With a kind word, wise advice, and counsel, and above all, with a sparkle in her eyes and the twinkle in her smile that lights up the room, she is truly magic. All of this is to say, Cyrus and Cecilia are meant to be together. We could not be happier for our family, our family. <laughs> Tout ça, c'est-à-dire, Cyrus et Cecilia sont censés être ensemble. Nous ne pourrions pas être plus heureux pour notre famille. Contrairement à Eugénie, mon français n'est pas prêt pour le prime time. <laughs> so I will be delivering my remarks in English. <laughs> we could not be more pleased for Cyrus and Cecilia, as well as our combined families. This is a tremendous, loving partnership, and we are so excited that they are now husband and wife. <laughs> If we think back to Cyrus's childhood, however, it is a bit surprising that we are here today. <laughs> While Cyrus certainly had noble aspirations, when we lived in London, his favorite activity was dressing up as Goody King Cyrus, with sword and shield and trying to order us around. But as a child, and somewhat surprisingly, he was painfully shy. Who would have guessed that, given the shoes he wears these days? <laughs> he didn't like to leave home. Excuse me, what country is Cyrus in this week? <laughs> and while everyone knew he was very clever, like many boys his age, he wasn't known as the hardest working student in his classes. <clears throat> Fortunately, and entirely to his credit, he decided to just do it and apply himself more fully taking inspiration from the 2004 Boston Red Sox championship baseball team, the amazing friends he made at Cornell, his semester abroad in Barcelona, and many of his colleagues in the investment world. The result is a wonderful human being that we all know and love. And we could not be happier that Cyrus worked his magic on Cecilia as well. To commemorate that effort, and in the Lancazan family tradition of singing at big events, we wrote a little song that we'd like some of you to help us perform. <laughs> As you know, Cornell has a lot of alumni here, and, and, happens, and happens to share the same tune for its school song with Swarthmore College, from where we also have a number of alums. So we adapted the words a bit to commemorate this occasion and asked Paige and John Hervé to lead us in song. So we've been asked that the Cornell people, oh, we've been asked that the Cornell people hold their enthusiasm to the fourth stanza so that everybody else can hear the words, hopefully. Far above Cayuga's waters, Cyrus missed his chance. Friend. 
friends, he was with her two brothers from Sicilian on a glance. Far below their hearts and waters, he had a second try. Several days all joined by brothers, his progress he did cry. In the end he won her over, she's smart and oh so she. We celebrate their love this evening, it's a values transatlantic. Lift your glasses, cheer them forward, 